What exactly is the number theory in which you've been doing your work? So number theory, uh, often they, we try to establish a dictionary between two completely different kinds of uh, languages or, or objects. And uh, the thing I proved is one such kind of dictionary, which allows you to translate from one, an algebraic world to a more uh, geometric world. And when you have a dictionary, somehow uh, you can sort of read, uh, you can uh, make sense of more things. Okay, so you essentially got this prize for resolving what's called serious conjecture. What exactly is this and what practical applications, if any, are there for this going forward? Serious conjecture occupied a very sort of important structural role in our subject. Uh, it was, uh, it was uh, when Serre made this conjecture, Serre, who was a very distinguished French mathematician, probably one of the greats of, the, of our modern times, uh, when he made the conjecture, it seemed inaccessible. Uh, although it was known that it would, it would have lots of marvelous consequences. So once one proves it, one has those consequences available. So it kind of uh, pushes forward the subject a little bit. Okay. Uh, Professor Kari, after growing up in India, you essentially have moved to the United States and you're living and working out there. Um, what's the reason for that? Is it easier to pursue academics and higher academics there? I think in the U.S., one thing which one is going for... Uh, uh, which kind of is stimulating uh, as an academic, it's, there, there is a much more broadly based system. In, uh, in India, there are centers of excellence with people doing excellent work, but uh, still, I mean, the, some, sometimes the critical masses are not there. So it sometimes seems like an isolated activity, while in the US, it's more or less kind of embedded in the, in the, in the kind of, uh, okay, in the culture. 